I don't know if we can outrun this wolf or not. Ah, shit. Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to get started. Uh, or we're going to do as much building as we can, which means that we're not going to get a whole lot done because I don't have a lot of resources, but uh, we'll start working on it as we can. So, uh, see, I got the boards there. I got nails, a few more boards there. And I believe that's all we need for building. Now, the other thing I wanted to do, too, is I wanted to make myself a shirt. And so we have enough hide there. What else does it need? Uh, a couple of these. Just enough. Look at that. Okay, so let's craft ourselves a shirt. It'll give us a little bit more protection, both physically speaking and against the cold. And this t-shirt is also a prerequisite for the better shirts anyways. Uh, so we'll get that going. Um, these need, could stand to be repaired. Um, oh, it only takes twine for that. Okay, I figured it would take more hide, but... Looks like it just takes the twine. Okay, so let's put that on. And, um, uh, yeah, let's make more, or cordage, I guess it is called, twine cordage. All right, um, well, we, wait a minute, we need cordage for the foundations, don't we? Cordage, nails, and boards. Yeah, see, I don't have a ton of resources here. Well, uh, but let's just do what we can. So, yeah, that's going to require two cordages. So I guess we won't repair our pants quite yet. Um, in fact, yeah, maybe we should go out and check the fish traps and see if we can grab a couple more cordages. Um, there is a thing up there. Let's we'll see if we can get to that too, so. Okay, we got a fish in there, and I have an extra grub. And we still have a grub in there. Okay, good. While we're at the pond, we might as well check for some uh, seaweed for carbs. Make sure there's no critters hanging out. There's a couple seaweed here. Alright, there's something unfriendly up that way. Uh, let's go back across this direction. Okay, we're going to eat all of these. That should get our carbs up pretty good. I'm going to, um... I'm actually going to start making some oil out of some of these fish because I seem to be doing reasonably well with the small game now. And we are going to need that oil, fish oil, for other things. Okay, there's a wolf and a chest. Um, crap. Okay, well. It's just, he might wander far enough away for us to nab this really quick. Good. We need, to, need all that stuff for sure. Okay, there's a bear there and a bear there. We need to get up on this. Oh shit! Where's that coming from? Well, that's not good. I don't know if we can outrun this wolf or not. Ah shit. What a fucking bad place to die. Can you believe that? He's a level two wolf. Wow. Okay. That is not a good way to start off the episode, is it? Where in the hell are we at? You you no longer spawn with a free weapon. Craft your own. Oh, well, okay. Hopefully that weapon we had, though, is still in our bag. Oh, shit. Where are we? Okay, this is our cave here, so we basically need to go 
southeast. All right, well, let's start doing it. That's our first death. Um, I've had a few deaths on the multiplayer server. Oh, that's a thing. So it's not my first death in the game, but it's the first death of this playthrough, which really sucks, but it was bound to happen sooner or later. So we'll just gather resources on, on the way back as we go southeast-ish. And hopefully we don't run into anything else real nasty. Good news is we died right at the camp. So at least our bag's there. Uh, that wolf might still be camping us though too, so that's not so good. We'll figure that one out when we get there, I guess. So, um, we did not get our gun back. That doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Well, actually, no, the gun would have been on our toolbar and toolbar response, so. Ah, oh, shit, all right. Um, what does it take to make one of these? Oh, we actually can make one. Um, can we make a shotgun? We've got one round there. We would need... How much cloth did it say we needed? We need four, so we're gonna have to go kill some more rabbits before we can make the shoddy. Um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna craft another pistol because <coughs> I don't wanna be without it. <clears throat> I don't wanna be without it. It's probably not gonna have any ammo in it, is it? <laughs> we got two rounds. Oh man. That was a shitty ass start, man. Shitty start. Okay, well, um, let's move on. So, uh, I guess we'll keep those in there for now. Let's eat those. All of this stuff can go in there. And uh, it was plant fibers actually that we that we were needing, huh? Oh, you know what? I think can we make some more ammo with those? Yeah, we can't. Okay. Let's do that. Put that down there. Let's grab the nails out of here, too. Looks like I lost some meat, so I'm just going to eat this protein bar for now. That's a bummer. That is a bummer. All right, well, there's three rounds. I still like to get that that thing up there. So, let's see. We were going to do this, and we can't because we need some more cordage. So, let's craft a couple more of those. It's just enough to put one freaking foundation down. All right, let's see if we can get up to this box up here. 
Oh good, there's another one too. Get some of that. There's some more cordage too, that's gonna be helpful. And we'll grab this guy. Oh man, look at that. Two shotgun shells and some arrows. Hmm, maybe we should go rabbit hunting. I have the shotgun in the multiplayer game and it's pretty powerful. Yeah, that wolf's kind of where we need to be. Okay, well we got some more cordage, so let's see if we can get like two foundations down at least. Um, not sure where that other wolf went. Probably went on down through that direction. Okay, so if we go here and we grab foundation, let's craft, we can craft two of those. Um, okay, let's do that. And then we're going to need more wood and more cordage. So that's three shotgun shells right there. Nice. Okay. Let's put that in there too. Okay, so we're going to put... Um, we're just going to keep this alignment here, I guess. I don't see any reason why not to. And then we'll probably come out one more. And then we'll build like a little wall around here. And I might do, I might do like a double wall. In other words, put a foundation down, put an interior wall, and then an exterior wall with some windows for fighting the bandits. But keeping our stuff inside protected. Um, that's kind of what I have in mind there. So yeah, let's bring this out one more here. Good. And then, then we're going to go that way and this way. And um, we might use this little area here to actually get into the base. I don't know if the bandits... Um, can come right through the front door or not. Um, so that's something I guess we'll have to discover too. If I put like stairs outside, then obviously they could walk right up the stairs if uh, they were so inclined. Okay, let's bring these arrows with us and um, we have 29 nails, okay. And we'll go out. We need more fiber cordage. We need more wood. And um, before we can keep the, you know, doing the building here. Now let's just turn all of those into sticks. I'd like to turn all these feathers into um, arrows for us. So, yeah, let's let that finish. Okay, yep. So, cordage. We need cordage. We need nails. We need wood. Let's do it. Oh, and I'm, I want one more grub, too, for our trap. Oh, good. There's chicken. Let's see if we can get that chicken. Got a little too close to him, but I couldn't see where the hell he was. Just kind of follow them for a little till we get a little closer. That yeah, should be good. All right, a little more meat and some more feathers. We'll take it. Let's grab this and we'll go down to the grub tree. Make sure it's not being camped by anything. Yeah, one thing I've noticed about this game is, man, you're really you're so much at the mercy of the RNG for the resources. 
You just are. Sometimes it seems like you can find a bunch of them in a relatively small area, and other times you can walk halfway across the map, and it's like you don't hardly get shit for the whole day, so... It's just kind of how it goes, I guess. Uh, where'd he go? He's in the bushes, but I can't... Oh, did I get him? Yeah, I got him. Okay. Uh, Alright, let's make some more arrows. If we make another stick, then we can make one more arrow, too. Okay. Cool. All right, let's go this direction. All right, I'm, I'm leaving. We have two grubs. All right, let's check our fish traps. They probably aren't ready. Oh, there's a rabbit, too. It's a bit of a long shot from there. Let's see if we can get around here. Yeah, I'm not sure where he is. Being in the reeds like that's gonna be an extremely difficult shot oh there he is Actually, damn it. Should have been a little more patient, but oh well. I have no idea where the bunny is now. We definitely need that. Is that him there? Uh, no. No, that's not him. Okay. Our traps, I believe, are right here. And then we got a fish. Um, because we've got this uh, chicken meat, um, we're gonna make that into oil. And likewise, same here. Okay, good. All right, now I need to make, actually I need to make another f fire starter before we convert all that stuff into fiber. I am definitely aware of the concept of ABC, always be crafting, but that sounds great in principle, but sometimes it's not practical. At least not until I can get some more resources to do some ABC. Alright, good. Here's a chest here. More nails. Oh, good. So we can actually make this now. Um, and now we can start making cordage with the rest of it. Um, can we make that other arrow too? Uh, we need another stick. And then of course we'll get more feathers from the, the two chickens too. All 
All right, good. That gives us a nice little collection of arrows. Uh, let's work our way back towards the cave. I want to get a fire going and get these chickens cooked. And then we'll go back out again and keep... Oh, shit, he's right there. Looking for more stuff. Um, all right, let's go down through here. Steer clear of Yogi there. Yeah, having the base in this spot in the early game is a pain in the ass, but later on it's gonna I think it's gonna be really nice to be in this area. Okay, let's um uh, put uh, this here and put some wood in. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> Get these two chickens cooking up. And that allows us to make four more arrows. While we're waiting on that. Let's put uh, this stuff in here. We don't need to take it with us. Keep our arrows there. Yeah, I can stay in there too for now, I guess. Okay, so we'll eat these two pieces of chicken meat and then I actually. I want to go get enough wood to stoke this fire, and then we'll go out for just a little bit more before it gets too dark. It is now April, too, as you can see up there. Let's just eat this straight up. And eat this straight up, too. Alright, let's get some a couple of logs on that fire so we don't have to make another fire starter later when we get back. Okay, that should stay running for the remaining amount of daylight that we have. So, uh, let's go back up this way. I can hit all of these nearby trees at night because um, it's close enough to the base. Uh, I'd rather, you know, hunt for more crates with the rest of our daylight. And look at that. There's one right there. Nice. Very nice. Okay, we'll take that. Oh, shit. No! Oh! Are we being chased? No, we got away from him. Okay. Whew. Ah, oh, crap, man. These things are all over the place. Everywhere you turn. Alright, let's go up this way. With it, you know getting to be April, or it is April, and with our shirt, hopefully I can stay out a little bit longer at night. The problem I had up to this point is it just get too cold. Um, so I go out, chop a tree or two down, and then have to go back and warm up again, and then go out, chop a tree or two down, and go back, warm up again. And uh, yeah, it's kind of a pain in the butt. Kind of a pain in the butt, man. Hey, at least we're finding some chess. Okay, we got some more bullets. That's good. Let's um, get five rounds in the chamber now. Well, not in the chamber, but you know what I mean. And another chest. Good. Got another thing for fire starter. That's great. And we got some of these to make more ammunition. Couple of those. We got a chicken. It's getting really dark. Don't know if we're gonna be able to bag this one or not. 
Let's try it. No, he saw us again. Shit. There he is. Man, visibility's just really bad here. Got him. Okay. That was kind of a lucky shot because I shot through um, the bushes there. Okay, let's get our ass back to base. And then, uh, yeah, we're basically just going to cut wood as best as we can uh, for the night time here. Let me check my map. Yeah, we just need to go down this way. All right, guys. Well, I think we're going to wrap up this episode here. Um, I might take tomorrow. Oh, are you kidding me? Really? Really, game? All right, let's go this way. I might take tomorrow off from recording and just do nothing but gather. Uh, because I clearly do not have enough resources yet to do any kind of extensive building. Um... So, yeah, that, that's gonna, that'll be the plan at this point, I think. All right, let's um, butcher that chicken and butcher that chicken. So we're doing fine on food. Um, and we got more feathers, so we're doing good on that. And we have 12 arrows on us, which is probably the most we've had so far. We got three more things of twine there. Oh, and we got a protein bar too, good, okay. Um, so yeah, I'm going to just um, probably take tomorrow off. I'm not going to do any building or anything special. I'm just going to gather. That's all I'm going to do. And then the following in-game day, I'll bring you guys back for the next episode. And hopefully we'll, I'll have enough resources to, you know, to continue building. Because once I get, once I get our front in place uh, secured, you know, then we're going to put the BCU down and then it's going to be go time, you know, with the hunters and all that. Yeah, it's still a bit cold for me to be out, so I'm going to have to do the run in and run out thing again. So, all right, guys, that is it. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.